out here fishing the hall thing. This is a <coughs> mangrove snapper. It's unusual to catch in Virginia. Pretty cool, still alive. Horseshoe crab. That is the most valuable creature in the ocean right there. They have blue blood. Blue blood baby. It's used in the medical industry for a uh, for a blood thinner or anticoagulant or something. Don't let him go. Got a few puppy drums as bog catch. We don't want we don't want them puppy drums. We want them big old trouts right there. Get them on some ice, okay? Ice, ice, baby. This little guy needs to go back on. <laughs> This is part of the net that we're pulling in, so this is a haul scene. It goes, it goes out, and then it makes a curve, and we leave it out over overnight. Fish swim into it, and they won't swim around it. It doesn't gill most of the fish. The fish just get, just won't swim around the net. So then we take the other end of the net that's out offshore, and we pull it towards the beach. What we got? Do that. It uh, just fish. All right, hold up, hold up, hold up. Getting the butt on the beach. Oh, it's probably a false albacore. False albacore? Yeah. Yeah, too big to be a jack. Yeah, yeah. Well, jacks get pretty big. It might have been. It might have been a jack too. There's a couple of different. Oh, okay, yeah. Was it round or flat? Round or flat? No, was it round or flat? Oh, it was probably a jack of some kind. Got lots of mullets. A lady fish. Yeah, that's pretty cool. This time of year when the water's still in the 70s, catch all kinds of crazy stuff. There's nice lady. I just had a, a big old mangrove snapper there just a second ago. I caught a few in the river. Yeah. Lady fish. Excellent swordfish bait. Nice. We caught in, in May in the pound though. We caught a we caught a tarpon in May in like 60 degree water. It's crazy. And then more lady fish. Lots of lady fish. Some stingrays. Speckled trout. This is the this is the uh, like the moment of truth here. We pull this part up onto the beach here in the next couple of minutes. This is the, the bunt. This is where all of the, we have a little section of smaller meshed net here. And uh, we pull this, this section up onto the beach last. All of the fish get caught in it. This little small blue fish. Mullet. Probably be some spot and croaker. Here's a little Spanish mackerel. It's all kinds of crazy stuff in this thing. Let's get it up here and see what we got. There's some big stingrays in there too. I've seen them. Yeah, I see a lot of herring. A couple of Spanish mackerel. There's a nice trout. Three 
pound trout. Another nice trout. Big old trout up on the beach right there. That guy just swam right up on the beach. The mullets jump out a lot. Everything's gonna freak out when it gets this next grab on it here. It starts getting pulled out of the water. A couple nice trout, Spanish mackerel. The river here in Chicks Beach. Virginia Beach. All same fishery is like, like over a, a hundred years old. This, this, they used to do it with horses and rowboats. Now they do it with trucks. Here we come. Gotta hold it, hold it up, hold it up. These things are wearing my daggone ankles out. Look at all these things, crap. I got a big old trout, about a five pound trout. Big old Spanish back up on the beach over there. You guys need to hurry up and get this thing up here. Find out what we got. All right. Gigantic trout. Stingrays. Big Spanish mackerel. Look at that Spanish mackerel. Look at them things. Yeah. Look at that trout. It's like an eight or nine pound trout right there. Big mackerel. Fishing for trout, we got them. 800 or 1,000 pounds of trout here. Alright dudes, I'm out of here. No, 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 I'm, I, I'm talking about 